Welcome back to Daytime Ottawa. Back to tell you that you do have time during the day to get in a quick workout. I know most of you, I don't have time to do a workout. Well, we have workout in just minutes for you coming up right now because fitness expert and author Kathleen Trotter joining us. Kathleen, how have you been? Oh, I'm so excited to see you. This is honestly such a pocket of joy. Oh, Seeing I'm... friends, being back at it, right? And we're going to get you buff and fit and excited to work out, right? I couldn't agree more. Right? I know, and, and so many of us have that excuse, and you hate excuses. I know that. I've been. I've worked with you in the past. And you said, there are no excuses. Everybody no. has time to get a workout in. And during the pandemic, I think it's been more important than ever to try to get as active as possible. Absolutely, but it's all about finding solutions and making it right for you and your life. So you can use soup cans, you can use frigates, you can use a fan, you can use laundry detergent. Honestly, whatever you have, you can create a workout. And today we're going to be talking about my 10 minute minutes workout. Okay. We're going to do 10 different exercises, each for one minute. And then if you have extra time, you do it for 20 minutes. So you can modulate it based on your time, and it's effective, it's efficient, but the best part about it is that you can do it anywhere with any equipment. So you have no excuses, you only have solutions. Are you ready to get going? I'm ready to get going because yes. we have we have okay. less than five minutes and you're gonna walk us through it all in less oh than five. So God. the first okay. three minutes less than five. is, is, Let's is, go. Stress, is stretching, right? No, it's stretching, it's sleeping. No, it's not, it's cardio. So you get okay. three different cardio. So we're gonna get a Jane Fonda on. So let's get your knees all right, up. Knees up, come on, knees up. Get my jacket on. You gotta get into it. Okay, right. you get your jacket on. I'm going to show the viewers what they're going to do. Okay. <laughs> okay, so it's three different minutes, right? Each minute a different okay. exercise. You can do high knees, you can do bum kicks. Now you're you going back to these Honestly, dance moves. I feel like... Yeah, exactly. You can, do, you can do a twist. Honestly, anything you want for three minutes. Okay. Do a twist and shout, right. anything. Okay, that's the first three minutes. They're very important to get into the groove, get your heart rate going. Okay, then the next minute is chest. So anything okay. to work, it's like a pushing motion. So you can do a push up, you can have weights on your back and do a bench press. I'm gonna really quickly show you what I call a pec deck. It's, you know the gym, you do that pec deck machine, you can do that with towels. Okay, so okay. you're down on your forearms and you go out and then whoosh, pull it. Okay. And out and whoosh. <laughs> Admittedly, you gotta do the whoosh. <laughs> Admittedly, I only brought one towel. I didn't realize we needed two. You, you know what I will do though? If you just didn't want to do the exercise at home. I will, do, I will do push-ups while you walk us through the next one. How's that sound? Okay, so you do push-ups. So then, next one is anything for your upper back. Okay, you hinge over and try, what about a bench over row? Fantastic upper back exercise. If you don't have dumbbells, use soup cans or take something like laundry detergent and do a row, right? You can just find solutions and it's fine. You're like, oh, household item. I got that. I can do that. Okay, <laughs> next. All right. You do something for your legs. Okay, so okay. I'm gonna pick up my laundry detergent. You take one of your soup cans, okay. and we're gonna do lunges, and you're gonna alternate back, oh, right, and I also pass-through lunge. Kind of fun, it uses your core, yeah. a little bit of balance. Yeah, you gotta make this fun. Like, do you know what a boring workout? Okay, that's, hey, now the this next form. one. Right, chest out, you remember from our previous sessions, <laughs> amazing. Think about your bum, think about your core, chest out. Okay, next, you would do some type of core exercise. Okay. A plank, right, on on your hands and on your feet, yeah. or a gauge, or standing. I love this one. It's a standing dead bug. You press, you get your core, you reach your arm, you reach your leg, and you you balance. So just don't let your foot touch okay. the ground, and really focus on your core. Great to get ready for winter. I hate to bring that topic up, but slipping, falling, right? Our balance is so important. Important if you do sports, right? right? Okay. So the next, I know we're running out of time. We would do another set of legs. Okay. So here's where you take your backpack. If you needed a heavy weight for legs. And you would do your squats. You could use your soup cans, right? Use my soup Anything can. you got. Yeah, use it. Now make sure you breathe. You go down, you sit your butt backwards, sit bones go wide, use your butt and whoosh, come up. Again, you gotta do the side effects, you know? Whoosh! <laughs> okay, so you, you do that for a minute. Now don't rush it, right? Just because you only have a minute, you have to do good form, always form before anything else. You've got two more minutes. The next one would be posterior chain. So that's anything that works your upper back or your butt or your hamstrings. It just okay. keeps you from being all bent over, right? So anything that pulls you open is posterior chain. So I love reverse flies. Oh, those bands you don't are have great. Band. Yeah. Use your soup cans, right? Do reverse flies bent over. You can do anything with any of this equipment. You just have to be a little creative. Don't have soup cans? No problem. Grab your towel, open your 
your chest, pull on the towel, and up over your head, open your chest. It feels really good, especially if you've been sitting at your desk for long hours. Right? Just breathe, and you're like, oh, Kathleen, this feels amazing. I didn't know that working out was going to be so much fun. I know that's what you're thinking, and everybody at home is like, fun. No, last thing, last thing. Okay. But for any muscle group, any muscle group that you think is your most important. So triceps, shoulders, it's anything you want. Gotcha. Kathleen, nobody has more energy than you. It's always a pleasure having you on the show. Thank you so much. And I know we're going to do this often on the show, so I'm looking forward to it. Yes. Hey, we're going to talk about I'm more so exercising fit. coming up after the break because Nikki Bridgeland is joining us. She's got some great social activities available and some great fall and winter programming coming up. We'll be back with that right after this.